At Web3, we constantly challenge the status quo. And today, I'm going to tell you some projects that are doing exactly that. Hogwarts, a decentralized cloud streaming network. We know that in the Web2 era, centralized gaming giants have the dominant power in pricing and data because they managed to create a closed ecosystem with their hardware infrastructures, softwares, and clouding services, putting game developers and players at disadvantage. Well, it doesn't have to be that way though, and that is exactly what the Polyverse team aims to change. With the peer-to-peer -peer distributed cloud gaming network built by Polyverse, developers could effectively integrate hardware resources, including GPU game platform resources with the blockchain technology. And this innovation on the infrastructure level makes a huge difference for users. Portaverse Network focuses on facilitating ordinary players to enter the immersive metaverse which they truly own at any time, from anywhere, and on any device by establishing a cloud-native protocol served as an infrastructure of the future metaverse. Portaverse has already made a lot of traction in the Web3 space. The team recently won the number one award from the Accelerator Stars program by Autobus Network, which is a Web3 infrastructure built on the NEAR protocol to help Web3 projects run app chains. Well, the idea is to serve each application with a dedicated blockchain. And this is exactly what Polyverse plans to do. We will build an application chain based on substrate development on Octopus. Uh, in which the on-chain part of the portable system will deploy our uh, proof of streaming protocol, as I discussed before, uh, uh, which is used for validating the work of uh, service providers, also known as uh, miners, and distributing rewards across the network. And here are some of the projects that also won the Autopers Accelerator Stars Awards, and they are working towards transforming the world from Web2 to Web3. And they are NetBot, a Discord bot that allows server owners to create and set rules for token gated communities on Near Protocol. And here is what the team has to say NetBot is the first Discord community bot for both NEP141 and NTP171 token standards. It's secure and user friendly with intuitive commands and quick role updates. And it's a completely free and public tool for the NIA community. Memology, an NFT-based avatar personalization platform. Users could customize their NFT-based avatars on social media with animated emojis, accessories, and AI chat filters, etc. And the beauty is, everything is happening on the blockchain. And as a user, you will own your own data, and that makes all the difference. And here's why the project is different in their own words. So at Mimology, NFTs are no longer static JPEG, but a full-body animated avatars with very cool animations, lip sync, voice filters, and emotion detection. Mimology is also open to Web2 users. Users are not required to have a MetaMask to use our product. QSTN, a blockchain-enabled market research portal where users answer questions, earn credit for their input, and spend them within the QSTN digital NFT marketplace. Why is it special? Let's hear what its founder has to say. We believe it's our vision to bring users from Web 2 to Web 3, and we do this by allowing you to earn credits, NFTs, and other virtual goods within a gasless environment. And if and when you want to, you then can export to your near wallet, avoiding gas fees. Thank you. Well, last but not least, at Meta, a metaverse app platform that focuses on preserving users' privacy. Users' private data is stored on the T layer of blockchain, ensuring that metaverse advertisers can precisely target ads without knowing users' information. Impressive, isn't it? Want to know more about Web3 and innovation? Please subscribe to our channel and follow us on Twitter. Well, if you are building a Web3 application, we got some good news for you. The Autopress Accelerator Summer Batch is open right now. Check out the link below and apply. 
you will get all the resources you need to make the world a better place.